mistake. You're north of the village. The truck carrying the nukes is heading towards the heart of the mountain. That's its final destination. We've got no intel on what lies beyond, so stay sharp. Snake, to the north of the village is a bridge that crosses a hydraulic pipe. Though normally the bridge is not used by people, if you slip, you will fall straight to the bottom of the valley. Be careful. What's a channel doing here? It is not for irrigation. They are hydroelectric pipes. I wonder if they run into Irasu's crater lake. Normally they would build a reservoir at the bottom of the valley, but it was probably too dangerous. Los Cantos means sword peak. You should be able to see across the Irazu mountain range from there. There are not as many big trees at that elevation, and you'll probably be well above the mist. Uh, it'll be tough to hide up there. You're not thinking about the scenery right now, are you? Not while I'm surrounded by bad guys. You should have seen it when the country was at peace. I know you would have been impressed. Well, that'll be our reward for a successful mission. Sound good? Wonderful. Thank you, Snake. There is... an old fort around there. What is it, boss? You sound upset. Well... you see... it was built during the Civil War. Let me guess. Disputes between Costa Rica's political parties escalated into all-out conflict. See, Conflict that cost my grandparents their lives. The most senseless sort of war. Countrymen mindlessly slaughtering their own. That fort is a reminder of that senselessness. Mm, sadly ironic, given who's occupying it now. That war was the reason Costa Rica abolished the army. Please, Nick, get them out of our country. I intend to. Chico says there's a bridge north of the village. Yes, a narrow one, for crossing the pipe. On the other side of that is the road the trucks use, though it's collapsed in places. I'll have nowhere to run if they spot me. They could be blocking the road, too. Is there another way? There is a path along the cliff. After you cross the bridge, there are ruins of a fort on the mountain. Going through there would be a little easier. Once you come to the end of the mountain path, you'll be at the fort. That fort was built during the Civil War. It seems La Cia's troops are occupying it now. Uh, this just gets better and better. They've got gun turrets set up all around from the looks of it. Attract too much attention and you'll really stir up the hornet's nest. Maybe I'll try and find a way around. You could always commandeer one of the turrets. A little target practice, perhaps? Hmm. Just like in Krasno Gorye. Krasno what? Sorry, just thinking about old times. Irasu has more than one crater, because he's erupted so many times. I heard most of them filled up with rainwater and became lakes. Calderas, huh? Calderas? Yeah, yeah, something like that. Hey, I got an idea. When you get to the lake, can you keep an eye out for weird animals for me? People all over the world tell stories about giant monsters living in lakes. Nessie in Loch Ness, Najuelito in Argentina, Ogopogo in Canada, I can hardly keep track of them all. They say that all these sightings prove dinosaurs do still exist. But crater lakes are isolated. They're not connected to rivers. Yeah, but do you know Mokele Mumbembe in the Congo River? He can walk on land. So maybe they moved there from some other lake. Huh. You sure know a lot about UMAs. There used to be a guy in El Frente who was a hunter. He taught me lots of things. He even said he once went to a place called... Isla del Monstruo. A hunter on Isla del Monstruo. Someday, I'm gonna be a hunter and catch some rare animals. Right after we restore peace to our land, of course. the bridge and head north.
You could probably climb that if you had someone to lend you a hand. Fulton recovery to helicopter is complete. Fulton recovery subject confirmed onboard helicopter. Enemies close by! They've got rocket launchers. Understood. Dispatching reinforcements now. HQ 
you come in. This is HQ. This is patrol. All clear. Understood. Return to base. Enemies close by! Take out the guys with the rocket launchers first! Understood. Dispatching reinforcements now. All clear. Understood. Return to base. Enemies close. Watch out for those rockets. Understood. Dispatching reinforcements now. Recovery to helicopter is complete. This is HQ. This is patrol. All clear. Understood. Return to base. Beyond that fort, you've got to get past it somehow. An intruder? Can't be imagining things. <gasps> the enemy's here!
start talking. Fulton recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. Inside the facility, there's rows and rows of trucks here. If that's where they brought the nukes, then the truck we're after should be there. Snake, can you tell which one of the trucks brought the nukes? One of them must have the same license plate as the one from the terminal. Exhaust still warm. But the cargo's already been offloaded. Just a minute. This isn't what we agreed on. It's too late. The changes have already been finalized. You told me it was going to be a deterrent that we wouldn't have to launch. I am not arguing with you, Doctor. Our goal is to create the perfect deterrent. That's why I agreed to help develop it. Mm -hmm. However, in order to achieve that perfect deterrent, we must show the world our strength. Three key principles ensure effective nuclear deterrence. First, you must have nuclear weapons. Second, you must never use them first. And third, and most important, if someone attacks you, you must strike back. Unless we prove beyond a doubt that these three principles work in practice, the world will not accept our new deterrent. And the only way to do that is to show them we are capable of actually launching a nuke. But isn't deterrent supposed to stop nukes from being used? Exactly. And so the one we launch will be the last one ever. I won't let you use my creation like that! Your creation? <laughs> that thing wasn't even your idea to begin with. You stole it, didn't you? <clears throat> uh, 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 stole it? You're one to talk! You got the idea for bipedal locomotion from the communists in the first place! You listen to me, Doc. Keep quiet. Do as I say. Not another word about stolen ideas. Should we succeed here, you'll be the toast of the scientific community. And your name will go down in history as champion of both progress and national security. The hell with that! Doctor! Unless we prove we are capable of launching, Peace Walker is useless as a deterrent. You used me! We used each other. I'll get my old director's job back at headquarters, and you'll finally be able to walk tall among your colleagues. Uh, I won't let you get away with this! How unfortunate. 
guess I'll just have to take your legs for myself. <laughs> Just come to us, Stark. We are going to have to meet it halfway. V for victory. Wait! <laughs> hey, you okay? Don't do it! Snap out of it! Where are the nukes? He's gonna do it! He's gonna launch a nuke! <laughs> <laughs>